Hey, it's recording. Hi, boys and girls. I know you thought that I was gone, but I am back. Very sneaky of me. <laughs> and I'm back to do nothing other than sing for you. Today, Miss Maccabee is going to tell you, or she's already told you, this is awkward if she already has, that you guys are going to be making rock bands. Get it? Because we learned about rocks. So it's a rock band. Meow. You're making rock bands. And you are going to be making your own songs up. Every year, when my kids are working on these things, I usually come up with my own song. But since I'm not here, I have to be honest, I'm using a song from last year. But it's really good. And so I didn't want to force Miss Maccabee to write her own song and sing it. And this is honestly one of those weird skills that I've just had since I was a kid, was being able to take a song and put new lyrics to it. I don't know why I'm good at it. I don't know how it's going to help me in life except for right now. Um, but this is what you're going to be doing. You are going to be using all of your landforms lessons, all of the vocabulary from them in order from one through seven. If you can, that would be best. If not, just make sure you have all the words in there and you're going to be writing your own songs to any song tune that you pick that is obviously appropriate. Boys, don't pick anything inappropriate. It's most helpful if you use the karaoke version of that song on YouTube because that way there are no words to describe you. The song I'm singing is to the tune Let It Go, but you will not hear the words Let It Go in my song. You won't even hear me say Let It Rock, Let It Roll, because I'm not saying Let It. I'm not using the words from that song. So I'm not gonna sing this whole thing because my voice is atrocious, my lungs are bad, and I just don't wanna put anyone through that. But I will sing part of it so you can get an idea. Landform song to the tune of Let It Go, sung by Mrs. Copel. Landforms are a hot topic right now, learning about them in science. Rocks, earthquakes, volcanoes, the land shakes and it shifts. The layers of the earth go from cool to hot as hot, from crust to core, this is what we've got. Solid hard earth, hot magma melts, the outer core is a liquid too, but once inside the inner core. It's so hot, it's a solid, cause the pressure is too much. That's our earth, mother earth, 4.6 billion since its birth. Rocks and sand make up all the land. We call all those things sediment. Once it forms into a rock, it's called sedimentary. Heat and pressure change it, and now it's metamorphic. When it gets so hot, it melts down into magma. Then it hardens into igneous rock. The plates go in, the plates go out, plate tectonics scream and shout. Convergent cause mountains to rise. Divergent plates make new crust. It's happening, this I trust. Transform pl plates make earthquakes. Watch out, California. Classify these rocks you find. Look close and see. I think I found a fossil. Thank you, boys and girls. I did sing the whole thing for you because you are just that special to me. I miss you. I love you all. I hope you are fabulous and good and wonderful human beings. I hope you have fun with this activity um, because I know we really rushed through landforms to get it all done by the end of the quarter, but now you have this review time to help you understand it more, help your classmates understand it more. I obviously did not use all of the vocabulary in this, but I did uh, hit some things. What are some of the things that you heard? Armand, what'd you hear me say? Yeah, excellent. You heard me talk about um, the different rock types, like metamorphic, igneous, sedimentary. If that's not what you said, that's okay. Um, I talked about the layers of the earth going from cool to hot as hot, uh, the, what the layers are made of, if they're solid or liquid, um, plate tectonics, the different way plates go. So I tried to hit a lot of things, but I was very rushed, of course, writing this. You guys will have today's Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday during science time to work on these songs. And the next Monday, you'll have just a little bit of time in class and then you'll perform. So I cannot wait to hear them. Hopefully um, you get some good performances going and hopefully you liked mine. I miss you. Be good. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.